What's up, Puka family? It's your host, Rhea. And I got my beautiful host, Yuyu. And on today's show, we're gonna be speaking about this beautiful Ferris bowl that was sent to us by Hookah John. Drea. Yeah. How about we put this bowl to the test? Absolutely, what do you have in mind? First off, why don't we start off with the HMD test? Okay. No perfect fit. No play. No, no, no. Ready for the next test? Okay. How about we test out the contents on the bowl? Yes, absolutely, that's important. What are you doing with the rice? Are we making a rojo con pollo? <laughs> Girl, just, just watch. I got this, I got this. Just watch and learn. Hmm, do you think the same amount would fit in the other hookah john bowl? Well, you mean on the retro harmony bowl? Yeah. Well, we can put it to the test and find out. Okay. Perfect fit. Let's see. Looks like that one would fit more. Would hold more. Let's find out. Pretty cool test, you, you. Oh yeah, look at that. Kind of deceiving, but no, it's the same. Okay. Same amount. All right guys, so now we're gonna measure how much rice we have here. So as you guys can see, we have close to one ounce, which it fitted in both the Retro Harmony Bowl and the Ferris Bowl. And with that being said, this concludes our test. Nicely done. The Ferris Bowl can hold about 25 to 35 grams of shisha at any given smoke session. And check out the wide gauge. We're used to a more narrow gauge um, this one is a little bit wider, so it, it, you experience an optimal airflow. Now, this one is about four inches tall, and it's about eight inches in diameter. Now, as most of you guys know, it was specially designed for the Lotus, but if you don't own the Lotus, it's okay because you can also use aluminum foil. Perfect. It comes in a variety of, of different colors, and it actually fits on most, uh, mostly all hookahs, right? Yes, it does. <laughs> You, this is pure craftsmanship right here. It's handmade American clay, and I believe it's stoneware. Now, the glaze that they use is totally safe and uh, lead-free, non-toxic. Um, they, if you can, if you look closely, they use like an overlapping of the glazes, and it has like a really neat, glossy finish. Now, my favorite thing about the Hookah John bowls is that it absorbs the heat well, and then it disperses it evenly. You know what, Drea? I'm really starting to like these hookah john bowls. Yeah, me too. You know what? You guys should check out the website. It's hookahjohn.com. There's hookahs, there's bowls, there's accessories. All right, guys. Really hope you guys enjoyed this quick review. If you like the video, do not forget to click the like button. Also, please leave your comment below. Let us know what kind of hookah john bowls you have, which ones are your favorites. And also, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. All right, guys, this is DMZ checking out. Until next time.